Brian, here we are, legendary Buffalo Trace. And we got Patrick here. I can't believe how we jumped over the fence to get in here. <laughs> <laughs> Patrick, what are we gonna see? I know Buffalo Trace makes a plethora of products. Today, we're actually dumping our antique collection. Uh, we've got the George T. Stag we've dumped, and we're about to refill those barrels. That's how it's gonna be bottled up and sold? Yes. Okay. So that'll be barrel proof, roughly, we would expect around 140 proof. Wow, that's a lot, bro. It's 15 totally. years old. Woo! So Patrick, it's safe to say that this process that we're seeing happens one time a year, but you only take it out of the barrel and re-put it in just with this brand, correct? There's several brands that we do that with, and it's just one time a year that we do this. So we're here at a special time. Very, very special time. So we decided to take advantage of this rare opportunity and get hands on and uncork one of these puppies. I split the damn thing. Next, the precious liquid gold is pumped into its new home, topped off, then filled to the rim, where it is recorked and sent away to age to perfection. Tell you what, Patrick, feels great in this spot. Yeah, there's some air conditioning in here, a little, little better, a little cooler in here. So what are we bottling up? Uh, here we're bottling the NT collection, so it's the Weller NT collection at 107, and these are SBS barrels. All right, so the bottling process, how many bottles will you kick out of this facility? Uh, this is a brand new operation. We've just expanded into this building and enhanced its capabilities. So we're running about 30 barrels a day out of here. We have three other trap bottling facilities. There's one that's a very small two-barrel operation, and then there's the Blanton building as well, where uh, that's actually about 12 barrels at a time, and they'll do that on two different ships. Are they bottling Blantons right now? It would either be some Takara or Blantons, but I believe we're doing Blantons today. Is there any way we could see the little classic horse head get put on the bottle? We possibly could. All right, Brian, what do you think? Oh, I'm in. Here we are, Brian, with a new guy, Lee. Tour guide, Nick, not new guy. Tour guide. <laughs> <laughs> so, Lee, with yeah. Blanton's here. Uh -huh. And we also have the Eagle Rare yep. also going on on the other line. Two classics here at Buffalo Trace. Yeah. What makes them so special? Blanton's is the original single barrel bourbon. A lot like uh, Albert Blanton used to do. Just one barrel at a time. He'd do it for friends and family and things like that, holidays, Christmas. Um, but nobody done it at a commercial scale yet. Uh, the rest, as they say, is, uh, is history. Now, there's a couple unique things, Lee. You get into this building, and it's not that big. It's really tiny. And you're expecting this huge bottling plant, but you don't see that. No. And then the bourbon barrels are coming literally right in, dumping. Yep, one at a time. It's like I'm stepping back in time. There's very little change, but for the most part, we're doing things the way things have been done here for 200 years. When you look at the iconic cap, you always hear these stories. Any truths about them? Well, there are eight different stoppers. Each horse has a little circle at the heel of the horse, and you put them together just right, it spells out Blanton's. Oh, really? Yes. Hey, Brian. No, 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 not that one. <laughs> well, I think the next place we'll go will be to our historic Warehouse C, one of our aging warehouses built in 1885. All right, sounds good, let's go. Right. That's right, the legendary Warehouse C, which holds the title of the oldest warehouse on the distillery grounds. Here we are, almost at the intersection, the crossroads. It's, a, it's amazing, Lee, the amount of barrels in this warehouse alone, just on this floor, what would you say numbers-wise we're looking at? There are approximately 24,000 barrels just in this one warehouse. Each barrel holds 53 gallons. Each barrel weighs nearly 550 pounds when it's full. Whew. The building's built in 1885. We're standing on the lowest floor. I mean, run. Yeah, stand here as long as you're comfortable. <laughs> no, it's, it's, it's a very well-built building. I mean, it's been standing since 1885, after all. Now, let me ask you, Lee, where's the 23-year-old Pappy hiding at? Well, it could be just about anywhere. It could be that some of the barrels just right here uh, could someday be that 23-year-old Pappy Van Winkle. Well, I don't know about you, Nick, but what I do know is I'm ready to taste some of this stuff. 
So it was time to enter paradise at Buffalo Trace's Tasting Room, where Lee poured his heavenly spirits. Everything we sample was crafted to perfection, offering its own distinct flavor profiles right to the last drop. All right, buddy. Cheers. Lee, thank you so much. Thank you. Lee, it thank was you. It was a pleasure and an honor to show you around a little bit. Absolutely. Thanks for coming. Come back and see us again. You have an incredible operation here that everybody needs to see. What a facility. And our tours are free. That's great. I'll see you at the one o'clock showing. Excellent. <laughs> <laughs>